Hello everyone, Mr. Happy here, and in this video I want to talk to you about a game that just got a trailer today that honestly looks pretty exciting. Now the name of the game is Neo, and some of you may remember this game from quite some time ago. Uh, this is a product from Team Ninja, the same team behind Ninja Gaiden, that was supposed to come out years ago. It was announced at E3 10 years ago. So it's basically Team Ninja's own little Final Fantasy 15 in their own way. Uh, it's also coming to you by uh, Koei Tecmo, and it looks like a pretty solid title. Now, I can't help but notice the main character looks like Geralt from The Witcher 3, and I've seen plenty of people talking about that. But the vibes of the game are all vibes I get from different good games. Now, it definitely reminds me of the Souls games, of Bloodborne, seeing the kind of animations and the way that the character holds himself. But it's also got this more samurai, feudal Japan kind of thing going on here, with interesting counterattacks and summons, even, which was definitely something I didn't expect. Uh, now, it's a demon-filled feudal Japan, obviously, and not only does it give me the kind of Souls vibes that, you know, I've come to expect from combat like this, but it also gives me an Onimusha vibe, it gives me a slight Ninja Gaiden vibe, it gives me that Witcher 3 vibe because of Geralt, it just, it gives me so many different feelings whenever I watch it, and I just can't even begin to name them all. Overall, it looks like a good game, and a technical demo for this is actually going to be out on the PlayStation 4 only April 26th through May 5th. So if you're someone like me who loves the Soul series, you're looking to get into Dark Souls 3 April 12th because you didn't want to buy the Japanese version of the game, and you're just looking for more action after that, this technical demo should be something interesting. Also, for completing the technical demo, you get a special DLC that will somehow affect the full game. I don't know if it's just a mask, I don't know if it's something actually related to the story, but it's like Mark of the Conqueror DLC or something like that. But anyway, let me know what you think about this idea for Neo. Let me know if you've been waiting for it for 10 years and if it has completely fallen out of your thought. Be sure to like, favorite, subscribe, and share, and stay tuned for more information about Neo and other games. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Until then, take care.